Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Christian Architect. Please don't forget to subscribe this channel for more AutoCAD tutorial. In today's video, we're going to learn how to make an AutoCAD title block and how to print according to scale. The first one, create an A3 size 420 by 297mm. And then go to offset 5mm. And then move your mouse to the bottom left of the screen. And then click the UCS origin. And then drag, bring it to the external rectangle. And then select the external rectangle and hit the delete. And then click the explode command and then select the object to explode. And then go to the offset command and offset 25mm, the right side vertical line, to the left side two times. And then go to offset again and offset 10mm. And then offset the bottom line going up three times. And then you can select the line and then hit the trim button and then go to offset again 20 mm and then you can offset the line and then offset again 30 mm offset going up two times and then you're gonna need to the trim command again to trim the line and then you can offset 1 mm just to create a separation between the drawing area and the information area And then go to the trim again and trim the line in between the drawing area and the information area. And then you can go to the text and then create a text. So the first one is client. So client is basically your the owner of the project or the owner of the building. And then you can go to copy command and you can start copy the text. After you copy all the text and then you can just double click the text and then change to the actual name. And then the next step, go to the insert tab and click the define attribute. An attribute is a label or tag that attach data to a block. And then tags, you can type in client, and the default, you can type in client as well. And then text height, you can maintain or change. It's up to you. And then click OK. And then you can put the attribute into position. And then you can start copy to all the boxes. And you go to move, just edit the better position. And then you can start copy again. And then after you're done copy, we'll click the attribute and you can just change the attack to architect and then the default to architect as well. And then similarly, go to the other information, just click and then you can edit. And then the next step, hover your mouse to the create block and then click. And then you go to select object and then select the title block. Make sure it's all selected. And then click the pick point and then click at the UCS origin 
or typed in 0, 0, 0. Type the title block name. Just going to write A3 title block. And then you click OK. And then the edit attribute will pop up in case you want to change anything. If not, you can hit enter. And then you go to the layout one. Select the viewport and then click delete. And then you can right click, go to page setup manager, click modify. And then printer plotter, change the drawing to PDF, paper size, change the ISO, full bleed A3. And then just leave it the rest, click OK. And then click close. And then go to the insert title block. And then type in 0, 0, 0. And then it will be positioned accordingly in our layout. Now what you can do is uh, go to the plot icon and then you can preview first before you convert into PDF and this is what your drawing will look like. And then go to the desktop and then you can try to save that. And now your title block is done. Now we have our architectural flow plan. We want to print this according to scale. All right. And then we're just going to copy the living area. We just wanted to copy the text. And then we can double click and then change to architectural flow plan. And then you go to the copy command to copy the text. And then you can select the text, type in PR, and then you can change the text height 150 and then change to 300. And then you can double click the text and then change the text to scale 1 to 75. And then you go to the layout one and then select the viewport and delete. And then right click, go to page setup manager, click modify. And then you can repeat the method like we did in the first one. Paper size change to the full bleed A3. And then leave it the rest and then click OK. And then go to insert. And then you can type in 0, 0, 0 so that the title block will be positioned in the center. And you can type in MV, stand for M view, to open a viewport and then double click and then move your mouse to adjust the drawing in the center and type in zoom and then type in 1-75xp and then you can preview the drawing before print uh, seems okay and then you can start save the into pdf and click the file name that you want and then click save There you go, we have our drawing according to scale. Alright everyone, thank you for watching my video, see you on the next video.